and it's uh, one of the most outstanding academy jazz groups in the Northeast. And they've been here four times at the IAJ convention. And they've traveled to South Africa, and they've been invited to the Montreux Jazz Festival, which is uh, uh, probably one of the best known jazz festivals in the world. So it's a pleasure to introduce this group, and uh, I'd also like to introduce Jamie Abasol, who will perform the third and fourth tune in the sequence of tunes. And uh, everybody knows who Jeremy Abasol is. He's probably one of the, well, he is the world-renowned jazz educator of anyone that I've ever known. He's just a wonderful person, and he's a wonderful musician. Well, he'll be playing, so you're very fortunate this morning. So how about a nice round of applause for the Milton Academy Jazz Combo under the direction of Bob Sinekrope. Thank you. 
Thanks very much. And uh, that was from the uh, islands, uh, Sonny Rollins tune, Duke of Iron. And uh, it's a pleasure for us to be here this morning. And uh, we're going to continue with a Thelonious Monk tune called In Walk Bud, which is, of course, about Bud Powell. Uh, we actually have two different groups performing this morning, so uh, these are outgrowths of uh, classes at the school. Uh, so you're going to get to see lots of different faces up here. In Walk Bud. Thanks. I'd like to introduce the uh, group members. We have uh, Seth Corman on alto sax, Henry Ladd on tenor sax, Alex Lee on alto sax, Guman Poor on piano, Alex Reiser on bass and guitar, uh, Nathan Bliss on the bass guitar, Josh Smith on the drums, 
and Bart Higgins on the guitar. Nice. It's a, a real privilege now to uh, invite up a really important mentor of mine and a good friend of uh, all of ours. Uh, please help me welcome Jamie Abersall to the dance team. And he's going to help us play uh, Bobby Timmons' tune called Moanin'.
Thanks very much. We're going to have uh, our other group come up now, and we're going to keep Jamie around. And while we're getting in place, let me introduce the group members. We have uh, Bill Ward, who's going to play piano and a little bit of guitar later. Bill? We have Robbie Lee, who's going to play soprano sax and flute. Matt Heck, who over here is going to play violin and percussion. Charlie Simpson is going to play bass. He's only plays one, one instrument. Uh, we're standing. We've got uh, Dan St. Clair over here with a broken hand, who's going to play one-handed piano. And we've got Justin Padro, who's going to play uh, drums. He already played timbales, so he's going to play congas too. One of the things we uh, do at uh, Milton uh, is we try to emulate the uh, jazz masters. So, for instance, the, the tune we just did, Monin, was an Art Blakey classic. And we're going to do Autumn Leaves, which everybody knows, but we copied uh, a version that Chet Baker did. Uh, and hope you enjoy it. It's got a little extra goodie in there. So, Autumn Leaves. <laughs>
always a treat. Uh, we're going to continue now with the tune uh, Caravan, which uh, people associate with Duke Ellington. It was written by Juan Tizol, his uh, fellow trombone player. And again, the, we uh, stole, uh, <laughs> emulated this uh, McCoy Tyner version. And it's going to feature Justin Pajaro on Congas and uh, Bill Ward on piano. And I wanna, really want to acknowledge Bill because Dan St. Clair, our other piano player, broke his hand over the vac vacation. So Bill had to learn this in a matter of a very short time. And uh, here we go, Caravan.
Thanks very much. Uh, this next tune uh, was written by Abdullah Ibrahim, and uh, we're really, really fortunate at our school to have a special relationship with this South African musician. Uh, he came to our school in 91 and heard the kids playing his, his music and invited us to tour South Africa, which we did. And we went back uh, for a repeat visit last March, and it's just a very, very special place. So this is a be beautiful tune by Abdullah, and it's called Maraba Blue.
Thanks, thanks very much. That was great. Good to you guys. Okay, we're going to do uh, another tune with this group and then combine the groups. Uh, this next tune we also discovered on an Abdullah Ibrahim recording, and uh, Duke Ellington was his uh, uh, big time mentor. And this is a Duke Ellington tune uh, called Virgin Jungle.
was a, uh, a tune that uh, I actually learned at the uh, 1998 IHA conference in New York. Uh, a gentleman from uh, McGill University, uh, I believe his name was Chuck Dotus, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right, did a clinic on teaching this tune, African folk song, by ear to your ensemble. So uh, it's such a great tune, and of course it was just uh, before our tour of Africa. So uh, this is a traditional Senegalese tune. Uh, it was arranged by Matt Dario of Orange and Blue, and we hope you enjoy uh, our version of African Folk Song. I want to thank you for being a terrific audience and coming out this morning and supporting us, and uh, hope you enjoy African Folk Song.
Santos welcome to the group. Wasn't that wonderful? Wonderful, great. I can't believe it. The songs that were created by this group is unbelievable. Come on, let's give them a round of applause. What do you say? And let's thank Jamie Amazon for sitting in with this group. Jamie, thank you. And I'd like to present this award to this group, this fine group of Bob Sinecrow. It reads Milton Academy Jazz Combos, Bob Sinecrow, Director for Outstanding Service to Jazz Education at the 26th IAJE International Conference. Let's give him another round right. of What do you say? Come on. Unbelievable. Just unbelievable. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.